Welcome back in the kitchen again with another one with Chef Ricardo cooking show. It's amazing to be in the kitchen giving you your favorite recipes and ideas. Anyway, today we're going to make a green juice recipe from a few ingredients. Very healthy and also very relaxing juice. Very good for weight loss and also detoxing of the body. Now I'm going to tell you something guys. These are the kind of stuff you want to drink at home. You know what I mean? When you drink this kind of juice at home, you can feel the difference in your body. You sleep good, you look, your skin looks different. It looks amazing. And that's what we're talking about. Now, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take you over here and I'm going to be showing you exactly how to do this on an amazing, incredible juice with Chef Ricotta. And the secret, we're going to put some sea moss. You want some good sea moss, remember. Check out oceanmask.co.uk. You can check out them on their website. And please remember, follow me on Instagram and my Facebook page. Please check out my website, chefrecorder.co.uk. The book link is up there. Go to my website and you can download it to your phone with a few healthy recipes. So today's recipe is going to be a green juice with a few ingredients, but it's going to be also healthy and delicious. All right? Now, if you want to request something, Leave your comments in the description box and thank you so much for tuning in. So, today I'm going to show you a beautiful recipe also. Um, I got a quite a few ingredients right here. We got some mint, we got some celery and cucumber green apple and some ginger and some lime. I did, I think I did a video like this a few days ago but um, I've been using the ingredients over the last couple of days and I can see the difference in my body. And even when I go to the loop, I can see the difference. All of these things is important, guys. A lot of people might have said, what are you talking about, Chef Ricardo? You're on a show or something, but it's real talk, guys. <laughs> it's real. It's not a joke thing. So what we're going to do, we're going to start it off with some fresh mint. I got some fresh mint right here. I'm going to put the mint leaves them inside of the blender like this. So I want you guys to see what I'm doing. So we're going to start it off with some fresh mint. Now, the fresh mint do play a very good role in our body. All right, put a few more leaves inside of it. Because me personally, I love my mint leaf and I'm always um, using it. Um, I remove the skin from the apple, ginger, and also the cucumber. I remove the skin from it. But before I go any further, um, let's talk about the sea moss. We're gonna also put some sea moss inside of it because this is very important, the sea moss. And as I said before, if you wanna get some good sea moss, go to oceanmoss.co.uk, all right? So we're gonna put one, roughly two teaspoons of sea moss into the cup like this, all right? Now, if you want to see how I make the sea moss recipe, please pop it over to my, um, YouTube channel and also you can watch the full episode of this beautiful sea moss recipe which I did a few days ago. So this is the green apple, I remove the skin. So what I'm gonna do, you might have said why I remove the skin? For some reason I don't know, but if it is organic, you know what I mean? And I, I do a wash it off very good, but I still remove the skin. I think it does give you a smoother drink. So we're gonna cut up the apple and put it straight inside of it like this, all right? And also, it's a very good drink for weight loss. We've got a nice lovely piece of a ginger. We're just gonna put a few slices of the ginger inside of it. Ginger, lovely. All right, then we've got some celery. That's the celery right there. Then also we got a piece of a cucumber which we're gonna be using. Rough about not too much cucumber, rough about half. And I remove the skin. You might have wonder why I move the skin from the cucumber too. I know it's organic, but sometimes it just give you a better drink. You know what I mean? Just give you a lovely smoothie drink, and that's what I'm looking for from this recipe right here. Um, also, I'm gonna get some lime. You don't have to use lime, you can use lemon. Right. 
I'm gonna squeeze some lime juice inside of it. Roughly about a rock out to probably about a teaspoon. Lovely. Um, also, we're gonna put some water inside of it, alright? Just some water. So basically, I make the ingredients and the water together. The reason why? Because you know the sea moss will get in really thick and the cucumber, 95% of it is also water. So but it's gonna be work out really good. So right there, that's looking really good. But the, um, there's a secret I like to use inside of it. If you guys have it, you can also um, use it. I would encourage you. If you guys got the um, meringue, all right, I'm gonna put a little bit of it inside of it, rough about a teaspoon. I'm gonna just eye measurement inside of it. This is really good, guys. All right. So, but that's the powder I'm using, and the powder is very good organic one I'm using. All right. Beautiful one right there. So, as you guys. Can see. So what we're going to do, we're going to cover it, alright, lovely, and we're going to, we need to take this to the blend, that's going to be very important for you guys to, you know I mean, blend up this and make sure, you know, everything run smooth, alright, lovely, so, I'm so sorry, I'm gonna have to make a little bit of a noise. Let's get this blender on. I'm gonna blend it up and make a little bit of a noise. Oh, now I did not use any um honey or sweetener inside of it. Sometimes I do put some honey and sweetener and all these things inside of it, but sometimes I just try to leave it real and authentic. You know what I mean? That's what I did sometimes. But as I say, you can also um put a little bit of honey inside of it, some organic honey, if you like to, but I did not this time, alright? Let's pour it out. And that's the way it look. Alright guys, that is beautiful, that is excellent and an amazing. Now I'm going to tell you something, that's what Chef Ricardo has been talking about all the time. So when I'm giving you guys something at home, you know what I mean, I try my best to give you guys something beautiful and nice. Now you can have that for lunch or whatever time, you know what I mean, you want to have it, you can have it guys, honestly. And a lunch, breakfast, evening snack, whatever time makes you happy, you guys can have it. Now, if you like the recipe, the only thing I would say to you, please leave your comments in the description box. Please tell a friend, and a friend tell a friend. Here's the thing, thank you so much for coming on the show. We appreciate the love 100%. Shout out to every one of you guys who take the time and watching this episode from Chef Ricardo Cooking. All right? 